last city, six wins in a row. Feel pretty good about this week, I assume. And how do you think that you can attack the rest going into the six game week road, road trip? And yeah. Come out where, come out. Yeah, so I mean, really, each day is an opportunity, you know, for us to um, work at things we need to work on. And obviously, we're by no means a finished product. And, Guys hung in there, picked each other up in this three-game series a number of times. And, uh, proud of them for doing that. And, uh, as far as you know, looking forward to having a Christian TCU going to Fayetteville, those places. You know, it's a it's a good opportunity for us again. Like kind of time of year to me that um, you know things are kind of coming together. And guys are getting some confidence and excited about watching them compete. You're up to 38 in your RPI in the live RPI. I just want to, I guess, how do you feel that this team has played over the last two weeks to jump from the upper 70s to where you're at now in that measure? Yeah, I mean, I don't think that's anything for our team really right now to really be concerned about. We got plenty in front of us. And, uh, you know, there's a lot of days to play baseball. And, and again, like the mental side of it and the, the physical of it's hard enough as it is. And, uh, like I said, we're not a finished product. We came away with three wins this weekend. And, uh, but each day is kind of you want to build as much margin for error as you can. And as far as RPI goes, you go play good baseball, that's going to take care of itself. Coach, you guys scored 10 runs in five straight games now. Did you notice anything different besides just you know, finding a gap in home runs? Yeah, I mean, I think, we, I think you caught us as far as that goes on a really offensive week with the wind. Go back to when Stanford was here. Ballpark played really offensive. Uh, played really offensive. I mean, you had wins this weekend. And hitters, hitters like hitting with the wind blowing out. I mean, obviously, I don't know how many balls went out of the ballpark, uh, but it, it plays more offensive uh, some days than others. And so that's part of it. Um, again, like it's, we had some good at bats in there. We had some bad ones, and uh, we had enough good ones to score some runs, which is cool. Coach, I think Matt competed, and obviously didn't have a fastball come in with Ted recently, but yeah, yeah. yeah, I think it's uh, you know it's really what young pitchers go through. I mean, to me, coached a lot of really good pitchers, and uh, we've had a lot of good ones run through here. Uh, you know that that process of uh, Growing up and going week to week, and you know, and understanding, you know, how you prepare for each start. He's very diligent about what he does. I think, again, I think it's just part of his growth process. And uh, he, he's got really good stuff, and really proud of him competing today and just hanging in there and just and just competing pitch to pitch. What do you think about Cash's grand slam victory? Yeah, I mean, it's a big swing. Um, when he hit it, you know, you're like, okay, get out there, you know, deep enough to be a sack fly, right? And it hits halfway up the light pole. You're like, golly, he didn't realize that was going to happen. But he got a pitch in the middle of the plate and uh, put a good swing on it. And anytime you got the bases full, you know, you're trying to get a pitch that's elevated and uh, trying to get inside the ball. He did those two things. You guys mentioned you're not a finished product yet. How much do you think this kind of week of being was just be at home all week and have these games kind of helped you going into this next stretch of the season? I mean, being at home always helps. I mean, it's uh, you're able to get in the cage. You're able to go over things and practice that maybe you hadn't gone over. And college baseball season doesn't present a lot of practice time with as many days as we play a week and as many days off as you have to have a week by the NCAA, in other words. And so uh, the week did present some opportunities to go over just some fundamentals, which was good. Uh, obviously, you know, managing bodies is always, you know, I mean, with this new building, you can take the training room, hot tub, cold tub, all the stuff you need to take care of your body, I and mean, that always helps. Makes it easier on Brian Simpson, right? I mean, really, to take care of them and sleeping in your own bed, never bad. Uh, you mean on Tuesday? Yes, my my main thought was was this morning and last night was just looking at thunderstorms. Just such a good chance of rain on Tuesday. I think that's you know something we'll get with them tomorrow and 
making sure we go over there and we've got a real chance to play a nine inning game. We've gone over there so many times, and, you know, and you sit around and try to finish it a month later. We want a real opportunity to be able to play if we go over there. And so that's the main thing as far as the starter goes. It's obviously not Urban, right? I mean, that's probably the first thing is Urban going to do today. So we'll, we'll see see what we got tomorrow. I guess speaking of Urban, what do you think of him? And did Parrish have anything wrong with his pitch? Uh, Parrish was down. He wasn't on 30 men, so he was down for the weekend. Um, and so, but as far as Urban goes, I thought he pitched as confident and uh, had as much moxie as I mean, I've seen him since the day I, the first time I saw him pitch. And so, um, that's cool to see. It's cool to see, you know, a guy ball and you know, hey man, like give me the ball and I'm gonna get some, execute some pitches. I think that was uh, something really good for us. And I guess get the whole clock to work. Uh, I did okay. I thought I could beat it well. Um, like you said, command the field every day. That's just part of it. I got to do the most I could. You guys now won six short games and looking to carry some momentum into the six game road trip, I guess. How do you do that? How do you think the walkers are feeling after this successful stretch? Yeah, uh, I think we definitely feel like the rough waters we had. Um, you know, the guys putting up good at bats, playing good defense, um, pitchers, I think, are throwing well. Yeah, I think we just need to keep going and um, keep that confidence level up. It feels like Sanders and Parker have really thrown the ball well out of the bullpen late. I guess what are you seeing from them? Maybe the bullpen sessions or just the way they're attacking? Uh, I think it's just the way they attack every hitter. Uh, I mean, not having that tennis strike one, and then after that, those guys are pretty hard to hit if you're already behind the count. So, uh, yeah, those are, those are just two dudes that I'm giving up. You walked six today, but that matches your season total of walks of six, I guess. Frustrated day, obviously, but I guess how do you feel that you've commanded the ball thus far throughout the season since today? Yeah, um, I've had command the ball for the ball the year. A lot of different stories. Yeah, a different story. But uh, yeah, throughout the year, I think I've commanded well, pitched hard. Um, yeah, it, it, was, it is been that so. Maybe one more from that. How much does it help to kind of get big opposite innings like that to kind of just boost momentum for you and just the team in general? Yeah, it definitely takes a lot of pressure off. Um, you know, there for a while it was 3-2 uh, or 3-1. Um, so as a pitcher, that kind of changes your mentality a little bit when they put up a seventh spot for you. Um, you can just go attack. You don't have to worry so much about if they hit a solo shot or whatever, especially with the win today. Um, so, yeah, it, just, it makes the game a lot easier. Uh, you can just go and attack the hitters. Man, I know you've had like a month or so in the starting rotation. How do you feel like you're just, you know, just a freshman, but you're out there every weekend? Yeah, uh, I think, you know, for the most part, I've done a pretty good job about it. Um, come from high school, you kind of have like a makeshift routine, what you like to do. So um, having a month out and work on that, um, I think I've, I like it a lot better than bullpen. You're just kind of, you're hot every day. So having that routine throughout the week help, has helped a lot. Anything else for me?